In addition to that, we got a boss fight, or... We got an enemy fight that I'll probably consider a boss fight. Except it's just Skull, so I, I'm, I'm fine with that. I'm, I'm, it's okay. It's alright. I'm not gonna complain if it's a, if it's a Skull. It's, it's good experience. I'm, I'm grinding on screen. I'm sorry you guys are probably like, oh, another one? But hey, I mean, we need the experience. I want to fight zombies. I gotta be level 4, though. Because then our damage output is just enough. Anyways, if we take a look... It's a mouse. A little mouse. He has a little... little chip. He has a little sound chip. It's nice. And we got another skull. Good. Uh, I, I'm a little nervous. I mean, you're... Level 3, you're just going... Uh, wait, did we level up? I can't even remember. I'm still under the impression we're level 3 and we're gonna get wrecked. Level well, 4 you can actually start attempting to beat zombies and they give pretty decent experience. For for now. That'll quickly become out like outdated, but you know, for what it is, we leveled up. You know, I'm I'm a little more confident now. I'm 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 feeling I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. And Akiko, I need you to No, I don't need you to use the vacuum, I need you to use the kit. Thank you. Alright. So, what we're gonna do now is we're just gonna go here, use this. Did I say move? I meant use. There we go. I'm gonna use that. I'm gonna get the other team over here. Get the other team, and we're just gonna go into this door. It's gonna be good. I'm gonna grab everything we can. Because that's, that's, that's what I do. That's what I do. We're gonna probably fight a zombie, because... As far as I know, they have a high chance of showing up here. Thank you. So much. Oh man. Okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna go into this battle. We're gonna we're gonna attempt it. They do a lot of damage. We're probably gonna need to use the tonic, but that's besides the point. Point is, we gotta we're gonna try to wreck it before it can wreck us and stun us. Okay, if someone gets stunned, immediately run. Because they, they will die. And I haven't told you what happens if you die. Um, party members run out of health. They 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 are dead. They're dead. Straight up. Uh, dead. They, they will not come back. There's no way to, like, revive them. Just straight up. They're, they're gone. And uh, the game becomes that much harder. Every party member that dies... The game... It's not impossible. I don't, like, theoretically... And I would not suggest it. Theoretically, you can't beat this game with one person. But trying to manage uh, an extremely limited uh, inventory space, I don't recommend it almost as much as I don't recommend what's about to happen. Okay, let's see. Um... Uh not who I wanted to leave. Okay, alright. Uh, give me a second, viewers. Okay. That didn't take nearly as long. I mean, uh, he just gets teleported into the room outside with the table and the mouse, you know, it's, it's not too bad. But it, it's annoying nonetheless, because, you know, part, uh, if a party member runs into an, an enemy and if, if you're not strong enough, it, it's, it's annoying. It's annoying. But we're, we're okay. We don't have to worry about swirly blue thing coming to get us. Again, those those things are really annoying. I, I don't like them. That said, I'm just I'm just going to take a look. No. I don't need to dust it or anything. Just need to take its picture. Sometimes, sometimes it works that way, but... Again, I wouldn't need to get Taro... Because he has the camera. And it's the only way I'm going to get layers to appear on this thing. And it's really crucial because this is a clue how to get the mallet. Because, you know, we need it to break the boulders. You know, but we we don't know where it is. The mallet is under the desk in a room with a small beast. God help me. You might be thinking, a small beast? Where have I seen a small beast? And then you're... Then you might start realizing, oh yeah, there was a room with a mouse. 
And I guess technically you can qualify a mouse to be a small beast because technically it is. It just seems a little weird because, you know, you think of beast, you think, I don't know, maybe some sort of horrific monster like entity. Like, I don't know, something with like fangs and like claws, like a bat, which in the other room there was bats. And Emmy is poisoned. But that's okay, because all I gotta do is go to my other team, get a Kiko, use her kit, and that that's kinda that's kinda the prominent thing, and I know what you're thinking. Man, this this game has been like kinda scary, but you know, it's like where where's the horror, bro? It's like, come on man, this is NES, you know, it's like the real horrors of the grinding and the levels and Getting to random boss fights that gets kind of infuriating. I mean, aren't you scared? Look at that guy. He's got grabby hands. I hate grabby hands. I mean, they're scary. They're scary. Let me let me just call everybody else and get them here and then go beat the ever-loving life from its undead eyes. Because, you know, it's, it's dead. But, I mean... It does kind of beg the question, zombies, it, it's not like Resident Evil zombies, I think these zombies have sentience, because as we know, they have actually said a thing. So when when they say zombies, I'm thinking it's just, is that mouse? Okay. So, yeah, um, sorry, I got off topic, uh, room with a, room with a small beast. And I was saying bat, but, you know, it said A, as in singular. And also, if you look, you, you happen to find the mallet under the desk, right here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna exchange it for this log, because I'm really not gonna need this log for a while. But I do need the mallet. And I'm going to get into a fight with a, a zombie, another zombie. But that's fine, because, you know, we, we can handle zombies. I've handled zombies. They're, they're not that bad. I don't have a gun, but, you know, it's okay. We'll just beat its brains. It's undead brains. Snuff its undead lights out. It's okay. It don't matter. Look at us. We're doing damage to this thing. I'm feeling more confident already. That's, that's a good thing. These bats, probably no problem. We got, we got upgraded weaponry. We can handle stuff. <laughs> Nothing is too difficult at the moment. Except for, you know, when um, little spirit with light things come and steal our party members away. That, that's still pretty annoying, but I'm not complaining. So far, it hasn't been too bad. I mean, it's not like the enemies are going to get that ability. Oh, that would be so annoying. I'm totally not foreshadowing to anything. I'm not making it obvious. What are you talking about? This is totally what I would consider the room. I can't do that. Weapons cannot be put into the regular inventory, as much as you think that would be a thing. No, it wouldn't. And also, you know, maybe I wanna, maybe I wanna exchange the rope and the wood, cause I don't know. I I wanna, I wanna hold off on the, on the uh, rope, cause it, that's also something I won't need for a while. Sooner than the log, but not not it, not as soon as uh, the next area coming up. I can wait. Now then, now we can get through. We can break these boulders, get to the generator, everything be good, everything be all right. I'll be happy, my sanity will be great. I'm not really seeing the horror, but you know what? It, it, it's a great place. I like this place. You know, it's a little dark, but you know, with a, with a little bit of renovating, it'll probably be good enough to be called home. We got a Fire X. Or, you know, fire extinguisher. We also got random encounters. But it's nothing we haven't seen. I mean, this this is a wisp. I don't even need to kill the other team. I'm gonna do it anyways because, uh... It's, it's a good way to get the other party members here. Unfortunately, I can also access my candle. See, that that's all you can do when you're being called to battle. You can only access your inventory and use items. And exchange items, which is kind of nice, but, uh, yeah, there, there's not much else to it. Anyways, I'm just gonna exchange this, let's see, I think that, I think that's the bad wood. Yeah, that's, that's, that's the temporary wood solution right there. Those items right there, okay. 
so let's say you do kill a kill a party member. Uh, you won't have access to their inventory, or at least I don't think you will. I've never actually tried. It, it's not a good situation to be put in. But you, well, at the very least, you won't have access to these items. So you'll kind of be screwed. You can't, you can't really exchange these personal items. You can try, you know. Like for instance, I can try to move. What? What? Oh, sure. I don't, I don't need the match. I really don't need the match. Okay. Uh, let, let me try that. As much as you want to, you can't actually mo exchange it with your personal items. You can try it, it just doesn't work. Uh, the matches are, like, those items right there are essentially like your, uh, your permanent items just in inventory form. So the matches are the lighter. The broom is the vacuum. We'll see what other people's items are later. Now then. Another thing I can do is I can go get that, but I need the wood. I also need to avoid this, this, uh, chandelier. Can I do it? I can! Alright! I always go by Beyonce's rules of going to the left. And you might ask why, because it's, it's, the first, it's the first thing I can do, you know? It's like, hey, I just want to press the button, move on with my life. I hope you do too, viewers. I hope you do too. We got, we got a game to play, we got an experience to experience. I can't be running to these zombies and having to call everybody so, you know, we can all get the experience. Level up. Go face uh, ghost lady that was in the beginning because you know she's going to show up again and be all spooky like just straight in your face boo but you know for what it is leveled up things are a lot easier now and I like it when things are easy come on it's it's good it's good for everybody so I'm just going to use this wood you might not have any indication to use this wood but I again if you know it's not like the game's going to stop you from doing this and this thing right here, this thing, well, uh, it, it's good. It's a club. Club is a lot better than anything you have at the moment. You will straight up just wreck everything. It's, it's pretty broken for the moment. And I also totally want, I totally want my wood. I'm not close enough, am I? That's the only problem. I can't, I can't tell how far I am to anything. I got it, okay. Don't need the stats. We're level 5. We're doing pretty good. We're not going to have any issues. Akiko's probably the most broken character at the moment, so we're just going to call her and, like, have her defeat everything. She's our medic, but she's totally our powerhouse. I guess Emmy is also kind of our powerhouse. I guess we also have a statue. Hopefully Beyonce's words will not fail me. Dude, she's totally- Okay, alright. Beyonce, your words have inspired me to get through this house. <laughs> Take a look at the note. Flashlight, shadow. Got a shotgun. 